we did not get anything as bad. The high winds and rains have some effect here on Ocean City, and that impact still happening, as you can see from this live camera at Mackey's Bayside, right there on 54th Street. You can see the trees just being gushed around. Look at that, look at that, and some choppy water in the background there. WMAR 2 News, Don Harrison is at the beach today to see how it fared and the work already being done to clean things up. Ocean City is feeling the effects of the storm that came past us from down south. Ocean City officials have been pushing sand off the boardwalk and moving sand around on the beaches. High tide came in at 5 this afternoon and brings the water levels up even higher. Scott Houston has taken many a picture since he moved here in the 80s. The northeast winds send seawater into the bays, which raises the water levels. And then we have days and days of sustained 20 plus mile per hour winds, which can eventually do damage on buildings. And then the flooding comes up and does a lot of damage on the roads and some of the low lying areas on the island. The only thing that's higher than the waves in Ocean City is the sand that's being thrown around by this heavy equipment. That's what happens every storm. Mother Nature pushes the sand on shore and we spend the next couple of days pushing it back out. Although the usual flooding happened here, no great damage was reported. These storms used to be much more impactful to our favorite vacation destination. Governor Schaefer started the beach replenishment project in 88. Sand was dredged offshore and spread over nine miles of the Ocean City Beach. I can remember years where there would be big winter storms where actually water would crash over the old dunes and then down into the streets, but that doesn't happen anymore. Scott and Katie Chambers and their friend Oswald came here just for the storms. The weather doesn't stop us. If anything, it just makes it more interesting. I just checked the weather today before we came out and I said, look, we got a window where it's not raining. Let's go see what we can see down on the boardwalk. Scott and Katie handled the storms like pros, but what about Oswald? Uh, but he still enjoys it. He doesn't care. It's all about the smells for him. <laughs> In Ocean City, Don Harrison, WMAR 2 News.